babies so i have been getting so 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 many requests about how i do my eyebrows okay so i am going to do a tutorial on how i do my eyebrows now i'm not going to show you all the different ways you can do them i'm just going to show you how i prefer to do mine for the time being, um, I prefer to use gel or pomade or wax or whatever you want to call it. And I always get the closest shade to my eyebrows. And I like to clean up with concealer and I like to set with gel. So I am going to show you guys how I like to do my brows. So stay tuned. So first, I am going to take a lovely spoolie here, and I have a double-ended spoolie. And what I like to do is I just like to brush my hairs up, and I just brush them up as best I can. Now, it's always easier to do your brows when they are arched, child. Mine are not. So my eyes are, eyebrows are gonna be a little thicker than I normally would prefer because you wanna try to go with the natural shape that you currently have. So if your eyebrows are not arched, they're going to look a little thicker than normal. Or you can, when you do your cleanup, make them look thinner than normal. It just all is up to you and what you prefer. So I like to use the Cabral pomade and I am the color five that's what it says at the bottom and this is what it looks like on the inside you can tell I use it a lot all of the time to be exact and it's really cute and it comes in this little thing and it has like this cute little brush on the end and I like to use the brush because it's just easier like it's I don't know it's just easier you know um, because the brush is really tiny and it's really little and it helps you get you know those little tiny spaces that you can't fill in with your hair so this is what i like to use so i'm going to fill in my brows and i'm going to fill them in from here to here excuse my nail don't judge me you can see I just filled in the sparsest area of my eyebrows which is my tail end and when I got here I started doing light feathery strokes now this is where the cleanup comes in because you want to clean all of the excess pomade off up here and you want to clean up your line and make it as straight as possible down here so what i like to use is the la girl pro concealer and i just like to clean it up down here now these are all my personal things i don't use them like this on clients but i'm just gonna take this and i just like to put a little half not even a whole drip y'all like a little half of a drip on my hand and I just like to clean up under now if you want to highlight up under your brow you can go a slight shade darker than you if you want to highlight up under on top though you always want to use you always want to use your skin tone some of y'all walking around here looking like y'all eyebrows about to fly off the top of your head you need to stop it okay the lord is not pleased you need to quit it quit it you need to cut it you know what i'm saying so i'm gonna take this here and i am just going to clean up now usually i go across because you know i usually do both eyebrows at the same time but for video purposes I'm only gonna do one. So 
so you can see the difference in my brows now if you want to make your arch mean you can do that on the other hand I like a subtle arch something you know not too mean just subtle you know subtleties Okay, you just want to blend in your concealer. Now, if you get a little bit of concealer like on your eyebrow, you can always go back in with that pomade. This is why I love pomade because it's just so manageable and so easy and like to fix things. It's just like so simple. Like it's just like boom, bada bing, bada boom, fix, you're done, out of here, you know? So, now it's time to just blend in your brows. So, the, what I've been using lately, which is what I love to use lately, it has been the brushes like these. I love these. They make it so easy to blend your brows out. I was gonna clean my brushes before the video, but you know, I do clean them, but like, I mean like clean, 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 clean. But I use these brushes every day. I want y'all to, I don't want y'all to think I'm playing in y'all face. Like I use these things every day. So I take this brush cause it makes it so much easier, especially for the top, for you to just blend it on out. And I picked this habit up from my best friend, Christina, cause she accidentally lost her eyebrow brush. And she just used this one instead. And I was like, you know what? This looks like it's really simple. And it would make your my life a whole lot easier when it comes to doing my brows. So I'm going to start using it too. And I did. And it was so simple. It's so simple, you guys. So I just absolutely love it. Love, love, love. Love using this thing. Just love it. Oh. As you guys can see, before, after, before, after. So this is how I do my brows, okay? Now, not to say this is the only way to do them. There are many, many different ways to do brows. Um, you can do brows like with pencils, powder, pomade, even liquid with the Wonder Brow. I haven't tried that yet, but I am gonna do a review on that very soon. So this is just how I like to do my brows. So after I've gotten the shape that I want, I take the Cabral Eyebrow Gel, and it's clear, and I absolutely love it. And I just, you know, I set my brows with the gel, and I love this because my brows don't move all day. It doesn't matter how I sweat, what I do for that day, my hair stay in place. And this is like an absolute must, you guys, when your eyebrows aren't arched like mine. Cause you don't, the longer the hair, the more they'll like fly off and go somewhere. And as you can see, like I definitely need an arch specifically in this area, but it looks nice. My eyebrows still look clean, nice and precise. They're here and they're clear. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is just how I do my brows. If you wanna see any other looks or wanna know specifically how I do something, please, please, please feel free to drop that below. Love, peace, and chicken grease, babies. 